Good morning. Pumped up to go to the gym. I actually prefer running at the gym than running outdoors because it's like artificial running. <laughs> Love it. Is it? Is that really a thing? But. I know I've become a runner when I genuinely enjoy running outside. I'd love to get to that stage. Next year, you're gonna join us for right now? Yeah, what about the 5K? What's that called? 5K, I think that's actually three miler. I would love that. Yeah. <laughs> cool, I think that would be a great goal by next year to be in a marathon or um, 5K. Good morning! We're having Pandisal. Pandisal from San Diego. Thanks, guys. We're gonna go shopping. Don't forget to buy milk and eggs, okay? See ya, bye. <laughs> Sophia the First is coming with us to yeah. downtown? No, I'm, I'm Ariel. Oh, Ariel's, Ariel's Ariel. coming with us. I'm so excited. We're gonna do the duck rides. Whenever our family from out of town comes, yeah, no, no. we try to take them to the duck rides. It's like a Seattle special. <laughs> It's really scary looking too. <laughs> it's like something I've seen like in a movie. I can't think of it. Oh, that's just creepy. <laughs> Beautiful! <laughs> She's so Is it Mia's turn? <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, it's just a diaper. There's a couple more like it. Where are we going, Juliana? The duck ride! Dude, I'm so excited. Danica's never been. Ken, have you been? He's never, He's never been on the duck ride. It's so fun. It's kind of long, though. It's like over an hour long. You think you have to go see the city. Yes, you get to get a tour of the whole city. Hopefully, there's not a long wait. Gosh, guys, what a bummer. The next ride is at 4 p.m. because all of it's booked. I should have known better since it's now summer. Dude, 4 o'clock. It's like, it's not even 12 yet. We wait like five hours. No, we're not gonna wait that long because then it's gonna be another hour for just a ride. And then getting back out of Seattle, it's gonna be rush hour traffic. So we're not gonna be gone that long. Go with Auntie Danica. I come with you. See? Anyone take a picture with the statue now? Come on. No? This is a nice statue. Okay, I'll take a, a nice picture. Statue. Oh, I didn't capture it. So we took a picture with the statue and he started giving kisses. He was giving smooches to Juliana and she was freaking out. <laughs> We're going to hit up the Science Center. I hope that's not going to be a four hour wait. Nice. Yeah, it's very artsy here in Seattle. I love it. We made it into something. <laughs> this, this place is really cool. They have an IMAX theater, which we're going to watch uh, Jurassic World. kind of feel guilty because literally yesterday, Benji's like, so honey, did you want to watch Jurassic World? Because I won't watch it with Val if you want to watch it. And I told him, yeah, I'd like to watch it. So. Now I'm gonna tell him to watch it with Val because I'm gonna watch it with the family. You ride a bike? I think it's like Does 50 power feet anything? off the ground. What? I rode it when I was a kid. I'm afraid of heights. Go try it, Ken. I want to. I can low key want to try it. What'd you find? Oh, the fountain. Look at the dinosaurs. How was it? So, it's like, it's okay when you first start and then you start to see downwards. It's like, 
Yes. Oh my god. <laughs> then you start tilting? Yeah, I started tilting like Mommy. a little bit, so. Mommy, yeah. Oh, well, that looked fun. You look like a popcorn. popcorn. Who would have known that we've come to Seattle to watch a movie? <laughs> this is gonna be Jurassic World 3D. Oh shoot, are we even in the right spot? Outside. Why didn't that guy tell us? Well, I didn't realize that the movie is in a completely different area, so we're across the way. Wait, Maybe set pose again. I don't want to leave. <laughs> okay, I'll go check to see if the photo takes. I'm gonna do the. <laughs> Put up Juliana. Put up Juliana. He's getting his hands in the air. I think I freaked Juliana out. Exit left. Oh, okay. Oh, share here. Scan your tick again. <laughs> Go with her. I'll take a photo. Okay, ready? One, two, three. Okay. I'm falling. You're not falling. You're falling? <laughs> okay, ready? There you go. Say cheese, Juliana. One. What are you doing there, Mama? Mommy. <laughs> Can you guys hear the music? It's music in motion. Wow. We are at the IMAX theater. Actually, this is one of the smaller ones at the Science Center. When people ask me, why do you risk death? It's not gonna be enough for me. <laughs> we're eating those reindeer cherries and we're watching some 90s S Club Seven. Band called S Club Seven right now. And the girls are mesmerized, which is good because they're eating all these cherries while watching this. Oh, the movie froze. I don't know what happened. Oh, we can watch it later. Can we watch it later? Yeah. Alan, trying to fix it right now. So if you'd like to go talk to guest services, you will get a refund. We can watch one. But if we say we watch it, we don't get a refund. <laughs> We're just gonna get a refund. I think we waited about five minutes and it doesn't look like it's gonna start up any minute now. And with a toddler. <laughs> Are you gonna watch the end of it? Because I'm just gonna read it. Are you gonna read it? Well, I, want, I can't just watch half of the movie. I know. I think there's probably about 20 minutes left or something. But like, we watched most of the movie. Regardless, it was still a really good movie. I was kind of on my toes because of Juliana. Like, there was a guy in front of us that was really annoyed by her. So I felt bad because, you know, it's a movie theater. So we ended up getting a refund and they gave us all our money back. I'm really bummed out that we didn't get to do the duck ride, but better planning next time. Doing my daily green juice, or at least I try to do it daily. These days I'm pretty busy. I've got a whole bunch of grapes, tons of spinach, cucumbers, lemon, and I'll be putting ice and water into this. Judy, she went to Seattle and she posted on her Facebook that uh, she was like apologizing to me because she missed that duck tour and I didn't realize her taking a picture of the family in front of the Jurassic World or Jurassic, I think Jurassic World sign meant she went and watched that movie. I was waiting to watch that with her but it's all good. Me and Bao going to watch it later. Uh, see you later, Mel. See ya. Adios, sister. Blue. Blue. <laughs> What's this one? Green yellow. It, oh, oh, green my. yellow. Maybe it's closer to a chartreuse. Wait, oh my god, it's called yellow green. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> And JB. Oh, oh. No turtle. JB, no JB. Turtle. No JB. JB no. No turtle. Turtle. Look at this one. Oh, this is your salad. This is yummy. And then. And then. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, 
Rectangle. Uh, are you hungry? <laughs> the beauty that just came home. I'm baby. Your baby. But no, she said I'm baby. JB that just came home and they brought me some food. I gotta say thank you to everybody that's following me on Snapchat. Benjamin TV is my name. I didn't realize people would be so interested in my Snapchats. Huh? Okay, I'll bring it to them. I thought what would be cool for Snapchat is put all the little food things that I uh, I love to put up, but it's kind of boring for the vlog. Is rigatoni? No. What is this? Ziti. Oh, ziti. Ziti. Is there meat in it? Yeah, with sausage in between. Oh, that's good. Yeah, I said my Love husband pasta. loves red sauce mm -hmm. and he prefers baked. Mm -hmm. And she said, well, it's not baked, but it's really good and it has sausage. I thought you were going to feed me, but <laughs> Comment of the day is from Megan Carson. And she writes, JB rolls her eyes so hard, I am fully convinced girlfriend can see her brain. Juliana, like I think she started doing it a lot because of the reaction that she would get from us. We would just laugh because it's hilarious. It's really funny and it's cute. But at the same time, like after she does it several times, it's like I do not want her to get used to that. And I want her to know that it is disrespectful to me and that it's not something that she should be doing often. In fact, she shouldn't be doing it at all. But, um, you know, I don't blame her for doing it again because she thought it was amusing for us. Anyway, that was a hilarious comment. Hello, babies! Did you drop something? There's nothing. How was your nap? What are we gonna cook? Juliana so nicely asked for popcorn, so I'm gonna make it, but she wanted to help me out. We got popcorn right here, okay? We, yeah, I've got a bowl for the popcorn, grape seed oil, and melting some butter, which is basically ready right now. And I'm letting the pan heat up before I put the oil in there. This is for deep frying, I believe, but it's seriously the most perfect tool for popping popcorn because it lets the steam escape. So we're gonna show you what's up. And we're gonna Snapchat this. Say Snapchat! <laughs> Honey, how long does it take before it starts popping? Well, that wasn't very fun, Daddy. It totally burned. I don't know why. I did it the way I, I thought I should be doing it. Yeah, we gotta oh, try again. No. The cover works for I use the cover, time. yeah. Let me see how much oil you put. Open it up real quick. Oh yeah, that is so dry. You didn't put enough oil. There you go. There we go. There, That's you hear that idea. sizzle? I'm just gonna turn this up. No? No, not really. Yeah, I didn't get that sizzle last time. I didn't okay. have enough oil. Any oh there we go. Okay, sorry, that's my Snapchat voice. How is it? Oh, it, do you like it? Is it tasty? Oh, okay. Well, she did like it.
what's the second thing that we do? And what's the third thing that we do? <laughs> and, 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 sleep with mommy. Yeah, go to sleep. I'll see you later. Have a good night, okay? Sweet dreams. Sweet dreams. Mm. Yeah, oh, uh, I, I have a little bit of pee pee on it. Let's go night night. Uh -huh. There's this uh, video that the Johnson's baby people shared with me and they wanted me to share with you guys and they've got a special campaign they wanted me to share this video with you for father's day which by the time you see this it'll be i believe uh two days before father's day as a father of girls it's just so much different from for me than what i thought it was going to be because i don't know why that my whole life I always thought it was going to be a boy that i would have for some reason um so when i was blessed with three beautiful girls uh, you know, my whole parenting style changed. And the one thing I knew that I was going to be with the girls outside of the obvious things like, you know, uh, discipline them, feed them good food and be, you know, as as um, systematic with their sleeping is I want to show a lot of affection. And I try to make a point to do that. And uh, there's no task that Judy does that I'm not willing to take on, including like bath time. You know, Judy's going to put a little video together. Um, of me giving the girls a bath and stuff, but uh, yeah, I think uh, not just being affectionate with them, but actually, you know, giving them kisses and hugs. I know for a fact that that's going to last a lifetime, even though they might not remember. And I think that's a great thing about us vlogging; we can capture it. But uh, more importantly, I'm sure it's not only healthy for their development, but it's a uh, a way that we connect deeper than just if I was like a parent that was you know disciplining them. Judy hasn't seen this video um, that I'm about to show her. <laughs> Anyways we'll put the link down below that is so cute. and uh, check out the video it's really cute it's only 30 seconds long so it's totally worth the watch and maybe you can send it to a dad that you know. Well, that's how Benji is all the time he's always so affectionate with his girls and yeah, I love it, plays you know. almost every single night. Yeah you know growing up uh, my parents they weren't super affectionate with me uh, maybe when I was younger as I got older and one, one thing that's going to be really important for me I knew this and I told Judy this I want to be affectionate with the girls all the way up until they're adults so I would love to hug and kiss them for the rest of their life and I'll, I'll never be too manly in fact I'll be more manly because I do um, show affection. Yeah. Anyways right. you just want to say good night. You Thank you. Day. And to all the fathers out there, if you're watching this, happy Father's Day.
combs your hair better, mommy or daddy? Um, daddy. Oh.